Hello and welcome. Let's talk about a vascular necrosis. So, what does it mean by vascular necrosis? It is the death of the bone tissue due to disruption of bone supply. It is also known as osteonecrosis, ischemic bone necrosis or aseptic necrosis. Now, this is a picture showing a normal femoral head and this is a picture showing the femoral head with a vascular necrosis. Now, the sites of vascular necrosis, fractured neck of the femur, fracture of scaphoid, fracture of talus and fracture of humerus. Now, causes of vascular necrosis, acute trauma, steroid therapy, alcoholism, sickle cell anemia, collagen vascular disease, Gotthus disease, radiation therapy and metabolic disease. Now, pathophysiology, vascular occlusion, altered lipid metabolism, intravascular coagulation, healing process, primary cell death, and mechanical stress. Now, clinical features of avascular necrosis. Initially, it may be asymptomatic and tenderness around the affected joint, restricted and painful active and passive movements, neurologic deficit, and joint deformity and swelling may be seen. Now, stages of avascular necrosis. Stage 1 includes asymptomatic, which is identified by MRI. Stage 2 includes there are radiographic changes with sclerosis and osteopenia. Stage 3 includes joint space narrowing and round contour. Stage 4 includes collapse of the subcontrol bone. Now, management principles of vascular necrosis. In early stages 1 and 2, biphosphonates should be given to prevent collapse. Osteotomies can be done and medullary decompression and bone grafting can be done. In intermediate stages in 3 and 4, Realignment, osteotomies, decompression, and arthrodesis can be done. In late stages 5 and 6, analgesia, activity modification, arthrodesis, and arthroplastics can be done. Now, blood supply of the neck of the femur, which is the common site for avascular necrosis. Now, this is the blood supply by medial circumflex artery, retinacular arteries, lateral circumflex artery, and profunda femoris artery. Now, causes of avascular necrosis of femur, fracture neck of the femur, sickle cell disease, hemoglobinopathy, Cassin's disease, hyperlipidemia, SLE, Gotthus disease, chronic liver disease, radiotherapy, and antiphospholipid antibody syndrome. Chemotherapy, human immunodeficiency virus, steroids, hypercoagulable states, alcohol axis, and idiopathic. Now, Treatment of avascular necrosis of neck of femur. Treatment is based upon whether the patient presents before or after the femoral head has collapsed. In the pre-collapse stage, treatment focuses on revascularization and in the collapse stage, the aim is to replace the damaged joint surface. End of the topic.